Hey, what is up, awesome people? This is Shady Wags with Got Your Back Gaming, and I'm going to show you an easy way in the division to get some blue items early in the game. After you complete the Subway Morgue mission for the Tech Wing, head back to the base operations and unlock that Tech Wing, which also unlocks the Turret skill. Go ahead and equip First Aid and the Turret. Now head back to the Madison Field Hospital and you want to replay this mission on the hard difficulty level. What me and Tommy Bruce found out by taking turns using our turrets we were actually able to beat this mission much easier with the two of us than when we did this earlier with three of us in no turrets. After you make it through the first two waves, there is a locked door which leads to a contaminated area. You do need a lockpick to open this door though. I found a lockpick breaking up a street crime as random loot. Once you pick that lock, run all the way back through the hallway and there is a chest on the left hand side. Just run back there as fast as you can and open the chest. You're going to die, but you respawn right back in this area. So you can run back again and pick up the items. We both received a blue gun and a blue mod. Then by continuing to coordinate our turrets, we were able to defeat the main boss and we were both awarded with another blue gun. Tommy got a nice vector which does extra damage to bosses. And I got a black market submachine gun which has a chance to auto fill the magazines on a kill. So if you want to get some decent weapons at the beginning of the game and you don't want to mess around with PvP in the dark zone, this is definitely an easy way to do that. I have not tried it, but I'm sure you're able to use this method to solo the mission also. If you found this video useful, I would really appreciate it if you'd give me a like. And if you have not yet, please subscribe. That is all I have for now. I hope you guys have a good one. Later.